Hi everyone. I've had so many requests to show how to convert um, studio files to SVG files in Windows. So that's what I'm going to do for you now. Um, first thing you need to do is run Silhouette Studio. So I'm going to start that up. So it's looking for updates because I have an old version of Silhouette Studio installed. I've got version 1.9, but whatever version you have, this will work with it. Okay, so I'm going to just create an image. I'll do the same as what I did on the Mac side and I created a rectangle and then I'll just put some circles inside it. Oops. Okay, I have to select it again. And then I'm going to take everything. I'm going to create a compound path. And I'm right away going to change the color of this to black. To change the color, you need to make sure it's selected. And then click the fill color icon up here on the top. Fill it with black. And I'm going to change the color of the lines as well. I need to click the line color window icon here. My image is selected and then I will click black. So everything is black here now. So to take a screenshot, I'm going to go to my start menu and choose the snipping tool, which I understand is available on all Windows systems. And it says the new um, snip icon is already pressed, so I'm going to draw a rectangle around what I want to capture. And I'm going to save my snip. Where am I going to put that? Um, I'm going to just leave it in pictures and I'm going to leave it named Capture PNG. I'm not used to doing this in Windows, so that's why I sound a little awkward about it. Okay, so that's done. So now I'm going to start up Shortcuts a lot. Starting up Shortcuts a lot. Okay, I'm not going to update right now. I'll just leave it the way it is. Uh, this is actually version 3. Didn't realize that. Okay, but that doesn't matter. The same thing will work. I'm going to now choose File, Trace Image. I'm going to browse for my image. Now hopefully I can find it. It was in pictures. And the file name was Capture. Here we go. So I'm going to open that. I'm going to update the preview. It doesn't show anything. Let's see. Okay, I want this to be monochrome and it shows where my cutting lines are. Okay, so that's good. I'll click OK. And so now it's done that for me. And if I go into the view option, I can show outlines only and it shows you shows me where my cutting lines are. Okay, so that's for sure cuts a lot. I'm not going to save that. I'm going to start up make the cut and show the same thing in here. Um, to trace, I need to choose this icon over here. Okay, so I'm gonna go and find my image, which should be in pictures, and there it is. So I'm gonna open that up. And this shows me my tracing options. I could make changes here, but this is very simple design and it shows me that it's going to be fine. So I'm going to import that. I'm going to finish tracing and here's my design. My cutting lines are there. Thank you so much for watching. If you found this video helpful, please subscribe to my channel.